Oh, I'm going to the baby now. Don't do it the action. Hey, Thank you. Because they've been telling us 
that going green, going green is what's making us poor, and that the solution is fracking. It's going to solve all our problems. But most people know better. We get emails like this. One says, I have no idea why the government thinks it's okay to dig oil and stop nuclear waste. The people are paying and the earth is paying. And another says, I have noticed how my fuel consumption is going down, but the price is going up. I would love to have a turbine. Where I live, it's very, very windy, but I can't afford to buy one. There needs to be more put into schemes to help domestic users find a way of affording renewables. Now, most people know that we can't just keep pouring CO2 into the atmosphere. People can see climate change happening already in this country with floods and other disasters. There's no way to slow this down except by insulating houses and public buildings and using renewable energy. The UK is bursting with wind, even the occasional sunshine, loads of waves and tides. But everyone knows that British gas and their cronies are not going to make that change any more than they're going to put freezing people above their profits. And in fact, thousands of people are locked into battle with these companies. That's why we're getting all these emails. So in lots of places, people and even some local authorities are starting their own power companies and cooperatives or fighting to bin British gas and the rest of the big six and run energy in a way that's controlled by the people who need it. Because clean, safe, affordable, sustainable energy is a human right. That's why we're here. Okay.